In lesson 1, we learned that the force which causes an object to fall to the ground is a pull of the Earth's gravity, which is a result of the gravitational field strength of a planet. In the course of dynamics, you may have been told that the acceleration due to free fall is the same as the gravitational field strength. But why is this so? In this lesson, we are going to see why the acceleration due to free fall is also the gravitational field strength of a planet. Objects fall to the ground because it is pulled by the Earth's gravity. This force of gravity is experienced by any object near the planet. The region surrounding a planet where gravity is experienced is called the gravitational field. We define a gravitational field to be a region in which a mass experiences a force due to gravitational attraction. When an object is within a gravitational field, how much force does that planet exert in pulling that object towards the center of the planet tells us the strength of that gravitational field. Therefore, the gravitational field strength of a planet is defined as the amount of gravitational force that that planet exerts in pulling an unit mass of an object. An unit mass means one kilogram of the object. Having defined gravitational field strength to be the force acting per unit mass, let's now find out why it is equal to the acceleration due to free fall. We have learned in dynamics that according to Newton's second law, the resultant force acting on an object is equal to its mass times its acceleration. So, for falling objects, this means that the force of gravity acting on the object is equal to mass times acceleration due to free fall. Rearranging this equation, the left-hand side is effectively the force of gravity acting per unit mass, which is the gravitational field strength. Hence, the gravitational field strength will always be equal to the acceleration due to free fall. Because the force of gravity is also called the weight, the formula of weight is therefore mass times gravitational field strength. From this formula, it also tells us that the greater the gravitational field strength of a planet, the heavier an object will weigh on that planet. And the greater the gravitational field strength of that planet, the greater will be the acceleration due to free fall on that planet. Different planet has different gravitational field strength. Earth has a gravitational field strength of 9.8 Newton per kilogram, whereas the Moon has a gravitational field strength of only 1.6 Newton per kilogram. This means that an object will weigh heavier on Earth than on the Moon. In addition, objects will fall faster on Earth than on the Moon. If you find this video useful, visit our website to get more free physics lessons and try out some self-assessment questions to reinforce your understanding. This site is specially created to help students prepare for Cambridge GC O-Level examination. Do subscribe to our channel so that you can be notified when we publish new video lessons.